Good morning. Good afternoon. Boys are on camera just long enough to go away. <laughs> um, anyway, how's everyone doing? Sorry I'm a bit late. I was actually set to be a bit early today, but the boys decided they wanted to play this morning. So, you know, <laughs> I wasn't going to deny them that. That's the way my camera is aimed. You can see the outlet on the wall behind me. <laughs> oh well. Um, all right, so we're continuing with Red Dead 2. So let's do that. So yeah, I was messing with... <laughs> My volumes sound a bit off. I hope they don't on the stream. They should be just fine, but... I was listening to music that was playing in my headphones. I had my headphones all the way up. Didn't sound very loud. <laughs> just realizing, I think... <laughs> I was playing with the, with the rats last night, and... They actually got up on my desk. And one of them started crawling over my mixer. <laughs> and I was like... <laughs> I don't know. Please, please don't crawl on my mixer. Don't pee on my mixer, please. I need my mixer. <laughs> I think maybe one of them nudged one of the volume bo bobs. If I like kick the camera or something, I don't recall. Like, maybe I'm maybe I'm over too far. Normally, you can't see the outlet behind me. One of the boys is in the red pouch in there. Yeah, he is. They get in there every once in a while, but I've never actually seen him relax in it. And the only way I can tell one of them might be in there is because the pouch is hanging like weird. And I was like, huh. What if one of them's in there? Just chilling. I've never seen him like sleep in there. They go in there, they play a little bit, but they don't. Um do anything else. Woo. Suddenly I'm going to have to start the stream with a sneeze. <sighs> Alright, that's a that's an excellent start. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's all my saltiness getting out before we start. So there'll be no saltiness today. Yeah, I think one of the boys is sleep <laughs> sleeping in the I don't know if I can show it. Yeah, you apparently really can't see it. I need an actual screen for them. But like that red pouch over there. I think one of the boys is in it, just resting. It'd be interesting to see if they actually sleep in it. Cause like I say, they've only ever played in that pouch. They've never actually stayed in it. Usually one of them goes in, then the other goes in. And then they start wrestling each other. <laughs> and for anyone that doesn't know, they're rats. That's what I have. That's also why I was late. <laughs> they wanted to play this morning. I showed a picture on Twitter. <laughs> One of them was up my sleeve. I'm on my horse. Now, where are my horse and me going? I got horse. Motherhood uh... and dreams. Mary. Oh yeah, Mary wants to speak to me. 
Also, all right. We're going to Rhodes. Uh, motherfucker. <laughs> Let's go to Rhodes. And we take this road. On the road to Rhodes. Oh, can I beat this thing? <laughs> racist and I can't allow this. Take down there. We go. I wonder if I'll get a bounty for that. I had the mask up, so they shouldn't have seen me do it. Yeah. I think I got away with it. Yep, I got away with it. Evening officers. <laughs> it's kinda weird how doing that is dishonorable. I mean I I get that I'm going against the law. But I'm potentially helping somebody that was wrongly convicted. It's good, girl. Five dollars, huh? I'd wager you're more than up to it. For the capture or killing of Camille de Millamont, member of the Lemoyne Raiders, wanted for stealing state property, crimes against officers of the Hello state, there. and murder of a postal mail carrier. Oh, he is French. Last well, seen in the region of Catfish Jacksons. All right, is he wanted? 
capture or killing. So we're so dead or alive. Try looking for that one out by Catfish Jackson's. Okay, where? Let's see. Catfish Jackson's is like. You got some shitting to do? How do you do, sir? Have you taken a shit yet? I feel like you're well overdue for a shit. It's been almost two minutes. It's you. We tried to get you last time, but this asshole burned. Hello, mister. They came out of nowhere, okay? Next thing I was regaining my facilities, tied up here. Please, cut me free. They got me captive. You're free, my friend. You have no idea how thankful I am. You ain't home and dry yet. Run along. I know. I think they hid my things in one of those boxes. Sir, they're yours. Well, guess I'm one of the good guys. Good luck to you. The last guy, I think, had a treasure map, but we lost him because, like, <laughs> we ended up Shooting one of the guys next to the fire, and his corpse ended up catching the guy. <laughs> ended up catching the guy that was tied up on fire. Oh, the fire went out. Oh, there we go. We got started again. my way to defeat some Lemoyne Raiders, I'm defeating some Lemoyne Raiders. <laughs> Completely unrelated. I keep that fire going. There we go. It gets chilly out here at night.
I don't think I got that one. Yes, it did. Getting dark out here. Let's toss another raider on the fire. Wait, the other corpse just... Oh, it's still there. It moved. <laughs> Fine brandy is for experience, which... Don't think I need. Uh, I think it's for health experience. Oh no, dead eye core. That's all. Just drank some fine brandy. Did I not? <laughs> Did I just drink fine brandy? This guy's stuff. Always reviver chewing tobacco. Find a box of stuff. Oh, premium. Premium six. That was pretty cool. I wonder if you can get struck by lightning in this. That's possible. I like how you see fire effects where it strikes. Really fast. 
found any like <clears throat> Holy shit, I shot him now. The eyes on it. <laughs> it's still glowing. I just want to carry this thing around because it's cool. <laughs> I also didn't have any my good guns on me. Also, apparently I still have that wildcat uh, carcass. Oh, there's the horse shit. Able to turn one oat cake a week yep. into 36 tons of horse plot. Day-ish out. <clears throat>
here. Yeah, a whole 96 cents. to say what the hell is this somebody's been in the camp there he is oh, Release me right now! This is uh, very kind of you. <laughs> We're going for a walk. <sighs> You're making a big mistake. You're Lamont Raider. I'm really not. Lemoyne, <laughs> whatever. Stay there. I committed no crime. I fight for your country. Not carrying much, are you? Just a bunch of pity coins. Oh man. You seek to deny my freedom when I fight for yours? I seek to get paid, that's all. What are they offering? A hundred dollars? Two hundred? <laughs> Not I either. wish you was worth a hundred. You're a cheap son of a bitch. I almost didn't bother. What? There must be some mistake. My name is Camille de Milmont. Yeah, well, blame your parents for that, not me. I am no criminal. I fight for you, for all of us, for our future. You don't fight for me. <laughs> In the future? Well, that won't be a concern of yours for much longer. We got you, Captain. Ain't no Lemoyne Raider going to federal jail. Here they are. Here's where we wipe that smile off your face, bounty hunter. <laughs> Go on, boy. Are you kidding? Are you kidding me? Stop shooting my horse! This is 
dirtbag's still alive. You took a shot straight to the fucking head. There's only one of him. There'll be more where they came from. Believe me. I am a realist. That's all. People need hierarchy. They crave it. Ah. Well, I guess I just ain't that civilized then. Please, take my advice. Better to face the truth now, uncomfortable as it is, than when it's already too late. Now here's some advice for you. Skip the last meal. Cowards like you always spoil their britches when the noose drops. You can go to hell. Oh, I intend to. Not before you, my friend. <laughs> now, shut your goddamn mouth. Slightly damages dead eye. Oops. Don't have anything that just. It's not a day in Red Dead if you don't flop your horse over something. a big mistake we're on the same side no we ain't yeah wrong building my sorry my i'll take you to the doctor that's not where you want to go right now i got the millimol he ain't happy about it. Strike me down. Sheriff. Put him in the cell then. You are a traitor, Sheriff Tomas. Sending this Yankee against your own. Quiet down. That's always been all you's problem. Too damn noisy for folks good. What we'll pay for. I guess that's what I'll have to accept then. It's worth much. I 
wanted to head down over here because there was like a carriage thing we can try to go after. Hello, you look hungry. Good morning to you. So apparently, I still have. No, now it's gone. <laughs> that wildcat that I got yesterday disappeared off the back of my horse. Then when I got back to camp, it was in my inventory. Got some gator eggs. Seems to be not in my inventory. Pleasure doing business. We're open for business, folks. Can I trust you in a ride, partner? Do I look like I need one, sir? Rush me, I'll get to you. <laughs> well, we hello quite again. Enough of your kind I got here. another one. To... You interested? How's things, Alden? Good. All right. This is a little different. Take the coach and deliver it to my contact. He'll pay you well for it. It's a fragile cargo, so go easy. Okay. But the money best be right. Oh, it is, Arthur. I promise it's very right. Okay. Head north, up the road, past Face Rock. Wagon full of antiques coming from northeast. Headed for a buyer and roads. Did you hear about that? There'll be a couple right of guards delivered to Samus and now. Emerald Ranch. Careful Probably not to I'll damage the wagon too. or the cargo. Yeah, that's the word in town. Face rock. I don't know where it exactly is on my map. Oh, I guess it's gonna go ahead and tell me. Good. I mean, I've been to Face Rock. There it is. Thanks for your assistance. I ain't hey, moving. I have a very Beg your part. Okay, we're gonna go rob a stagecoach, or steal a coach, or something. I need to be doing the side stuff. Like, I mean, I've been doing the hunting. I need to do, like, some of the games and whatnot and the challenges. Let's show them how free and some killing. 
ears. <laughs> I knew when I heard that whistle something was about to go down. Thing up here. Means I'll probably miss the coach, but he's broke. guy hey mister oh it's you too oh, hey friend you boys don't look so fresh we ain't I think we're dying friend we ate some bad mushrooms bad business sure it's been real tough partner so it seems I hate to ask but we need some medicine kind of fast medicine yeah look at us look at me and he's worse than he looks uh oh and he looks like shit <laughs> he ain't gonna last three days and me i ain't well not at all not at all uh, i'm i'm begging you partner You're right on the spot. Oh, oh, why? I told you to help us. I told you. I told you, did I? You did. You told me. You told me a lot of things. We're gonna be all right, buddy. Are we? Well, physically. Drink this. I'll give it to Black first. No, no, no. no I'll give it to White. No, He's... no. Drink uh, this and shut it. up. Thank you. Oh, uh, well, that's good stuff. Uh, but listen, uh, I reckon you cocaine. boys should get on out of here. Maybe uh, split up. Uh, Head up north or overseas. Uh, they don't like uh, groups of men. Uh, I know. I hear you, boss. It's time. Oh, once we're better. Oh, yeah, well, I agree. I mean, I, I, I can't wait to be with you. Embarrassing. Embarrassing. <laughs> yeah, you're in a They're going to end up together and married, aren't they? All right, <laughs> back to this path that is, for some reason, guiding me in completely the opposite direction to go. So we can just talk to him. Hey, Stygian. Let's see if we can talk him now. Hey, stop! What's the problem? 
Come on now, giddy up. Your back left wheel seems shaky to me. Looks like it's about to come off. Yeah? Ah, shit. Maxwell, go take a look. Right. How did you live? Turn this thing around without damaging it. Yep. Morning, at least at least on your end I mean for me I've only been up a couple hours so it is afternoon though get this thing all the way back to Emerald Ranch See, she's not a pony, and you think you're gonna make her a mascot. Oh, what kind you got? After the stream, or during. maybe when I take a break, I'll probably have to take a break in a little while. So, I'm afraid to go faster than this, but. Take us forever to get there at this place. A little bit faster. I earned any dishonor for doing these, so... I'm really worried about it. <laughs> Earning... Staying on the honorable side it really isn't that hard. Admittedly, like much like one of the one of the meme states is like my no consequences power fantasy is being able to help everyone. <laughs> Though I do do some bad stuff once in a while. Well, it was like when I learned in this game you can't really bump into people that much and just be a jerk. <laughs> Because everyone pulls a gun on you. But I guess that kind of explains something, right? When you're in a country where everybody owns a gun, <laughs> and you just slightly nudge someone, 
So they just draw on you and start shooting immediately. Four picks of her full design. So her full design showed up. Alright. Look forward to checking it out. I used to have a fox girl kind of as my mascot, but then I kind of dove head first into pony. <laughs> and I mean, I've always been a fan of pony since I was young, so I kind of like my pony version better. Not so much as a statement on like current fandom, I just enjoy her. Also, right at the end. The hell you done to this poor thing? I did shit. I swear, if that yeah. little pleasure nudge there caused me to lose the cost. Along. This is a tight ranch. Folk here got no time for masks. And actually, see how much I got out of that. <laughs> Forty, thank you. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention when it happened. Let's head out this way because I need a bison skin. Since I'm kind of out on this side of the map. I think I also need a rabbit skin, don't I? Alive, and now it's a half brain dead. <laughs> but yeah, I think for that one little exhibit thing, I think I have to have a rabbit pelt. I've got the squirrels. But I also need a bison for crafting. Yep. Go a little faster, jeez. Road. <laughs> the, the mark's right over there. I meant 
to defuse the situation and not shoot the guy, but this is where we are now. This is the reality we now live in. <laughs> I accidentally shot instead of defused. I didn't realize I, I shouldn't have had my gun out though. I thought I put it away. Gun in here. Red roll. I got a carbine repeater. Some premium cigs. Nice. How can I get high from sniffing Pepsi? My friend said he got high from sniffing Coke, but you only have Pepsi. What's the proper way to get high? Let's pour some mussy. <laughs> Uh, it's the bubbles, you know, it's it's the bubbles that do it. That's why that's why when someone orders a Coke and it goes, Pepsi okay? They go, no. <laughs> Absolutely not. Warm a rum. Why can't I take? Apparently I'm very slowly standing up in the background. I think it's his mum in this urn over here. I feel like there's a treasure or something we could have got from here, but... I accidentally shot the owner. Well, <laughs> I didn't accidentally shoot him, I just accidentally antagonized him. Another set. <laughs> One of twelve. It's too many sets of cards. Gotta do them right. Well, <laughs> let's try this again. He was an honorable man. He gets a Viking burial. Take him inside. Hi. 
<laughs> Just put them up on the mantle. It's a mantelpiece. Nice. Anything else I can take? Imagine if at the end of the game you get this massive bounty. And this one NPC you just killed was the one that would have saved you. <laughs> well, there it goes. That's a, that sounds like one of the um, like old Fallout games, like 1 or 2. Where you could actually do something like that and totally just fuck yourself. Watch, there'll probably be a bounty or something there. And like, watch with that guy uh, back at Catfish. Uh, just kind of, we had to collect the guy for, uh, we had to collect that debt from the guy at that Catfish place. And um, I'd accidentally kind of killed him. I... <laughs> and so I was meant to collect the debt from him, but he was dead already. So we just went ahead and grabbed the money. Alright, well, somewhere out here we ought to see some bison, so. Just gotta plot twist this. <laughs> like, how the hell would I have known? Pretty much. A lot of older games were like that, too. You'd just be playing around and then you just do something that you wouldn't even know fucked you over way down the line. Yeah. old RPGs did that. Even worse is like, <laughs> you'd end up having ones like that, and then you couldn't beat the game because of it. But you ended up like investing, investing another like, 10 hours into it before you realized you weren't going to be able to beat it. Auto-targeted that. <laughs> Why can't he usually auto-target? I see a rabbit. <coughs> Otherwise, I'm looking for bison. Dynamic weather in this game is amazing. Arthur, you need to collect debt from this guy about that. Pretty much that's how it went. I was still a bit, I just had to search for the debt because it was somewhere in the house, but yeah. I already killed the guy entirely by accident. I just, well, <coughs> in this game you can't really knock someone out unless the plot demands it. Otherwise, you knock them out, they just die. Shit. About as much on you as it was on me, horse. How'd you not see that coming? I'm 
sorry, what? And there's the horse plot. <laughs> need to be a bit more serious. I'm looking for bikes in here. They're probably out up here somewhere. I think tornadoes can form in this game. I swear I've seen one in somebody else's play, but... I've not actually seen it in my own. There. Ooh, there's a snake in there. Christ, it's getting dark. <laughs> oh, because it's getting night. <laughs> That's why. What's the best way to take care of a bison? Doesn't look like I know. High powered weapons like the carbine rifle, a bow with improved arrows should also be considered when hunting. Okay, so I can just use a carbine rifle on these guys. Sorry, stretchy. <laughs> well, your new OC is blah. OC is named. Is it Mir Mir blah. Mirel or Muriel or Mirel? Mire Mire. Oh, I see. Yeah. Carbine repeater strong enough to actually. Oh, 
asshole is actually hiding behind the tree. possibly survive that. rifle is this carbine repeater is not enough wait it's a half moon and we're here this is the place I was looking for that weird ass place I was looking for. But you're like supposed to come here on a half moon or something. Which it's almost morning. No? It looks like it was a half moon, though, didn't it? I can't see it anymore. Might be too late. So I think you had to come here in the middle of the night. Methyl, methyl, something, whatever it is. Yeah, this is this is the place I was looking for. But I think it said you had to come here during a half moon. And like be here at midnight. Uh, the shit. <laughs> was that a fucking UFO? Did I just chase it off? Should I just stood so oh, crap, should I just have stood still? Could reload? Maybe? How long ago was the last autosave? Like a minute ago. Try it. it might have been right after it happened. That might have auto saved like right after it happened, but maybe. Where is it? 
too late. It's not too late, we'll just stand here. It might have auto saved right after it happened. Just what it seems like it might have happened. Man, what are the odds, though? Chasing Buffalo on the right night that just happens to lead me here. Yeah, I think we missed it. Be able to tell what time it is if you have a watch, which usually I have a watch. I usually always keep one on me. Yeah, I think I either scared it off or... But I mean, of course my reaction was going to be to run outside and see what it was. How am I supposed to know not to run outside? <laughs> Maybe... I think it'll be a half moon tomorrow night. I don't know how fast the moon phases are. I feel like it was a full moon not long ago. All right, but we need to remember where this is. It's north of Emerald Ranch. It's that place north of Emerald Ranch. Okay. So that's what I need to remember. Just camp out overnight. Just stay a whole day here. And then see if um tomorrow night's a half moon.
It's a fucking UFO, though. <laughs> I sleep. I'll sleep until evening. And then we can see, like, what time. Uh, if it's still gonna be a half moon. If it is, we'll just hang out here. And hopefully, we didn't. Hopefully, we didn't, like, screw it up. Chill out around here, maybe do a couple things. And yeah. Let's see what, um... If it's a half moon, we'll come back. Okay, then, girl. Where am I? <laughs> I don't actually know where I'm at. How did I get down here? Ugh, I set up camp up here. How am I down here? The thing of it is, is I don't know what... I would have slept till night, but I don't know what time he wakes up at night. So I don't want to be too late. Like I say, we'll just chill around here. We'll see if it's going to be a half moon. And if it is, we'll go back. If not, we'll move on. At least now I rem now I know where it is. It's the it's the place north of Emerald Ranch. I had completely missed where it was. Easy now. An opossum. <laughs> it's literally playing dead. Actually, seen a possum play dead. Let me help. I don't know what kind it is. Animal behavior in this game is awesome. It is. It's just a rodent. It doesn't even have a name. It's just called rodent. Virginia possum. There we go. Good pill. It wouldn't let me study it, though. Okay. By the way, possums are nice creatures. <laughs> they don't do any harm, and they eat a lot of the bad ticks and everything. But for the sake of this game, I'm going to kill it. <laughs> Yeah, they did. They spent a lot of time getting the animal behavior in this game. Quite right. Come on, girl. 
Except the occasional horse that pulls the Skyrim. Where you see him like... <laughs> like half on a table or something. I got a screenshot uh, from yesterday when that happened. There was a horse like half on a wagon just like... <laughs> Kinda gave me a look of like mind your own damn business. All right, so let's let's hope it's a half moon. But if it's not, I'll we'll just have to keep an eye out. Also, I don't know where the bison went. And I'm hoping I'm hoping we didn't just permanently scare off the UFO. That is an event we just totally fucked. Ah. Not tonight. All right. Cool. Yeah. All right, but yeah, I know where it is now, so we can kind of keep an eye on it and come back. something more powerful than this freaking carbine. This carbine does not do much damage. The rifle does, the Springfield rifle does more. that one in the distance. Compendium updated for it. Okay, so... Oh no, not a carbine rifle. A Carcano rifle. Oh, not carbine. I read that wrong. Or bow with improved arrows. I don't know if I made any improved arrows. I might have, but I don't think I did. Okay, I'm close enough to be in my horse. There we go. Um. Small game. Fire. Regular. Small game. I don't think I have a shotgun. So I guess we'll try it with the Gun's powerful enough. I'm just winging them. Easy.
<laughs> Might not be any three stars left. Try and lead the shot. Fuck! It's like, it's like they stop just before I take the, the shot. Like I'm trying to, you know, predict the, their path and then they just momentarily stop right when I pull the trigger. Cause it's gotta be a headshot otherwise it won't be clean. Not enough. Gun's not strong enough. Alright, well, no bison then. this thing in, it's fine. Easy, easy. This gun is in shite condition. It's probably why dudes are surviving headshots. We know where to come back to. Where's Emerald Ranch? So yeah, it's this place right here. That's where we need to go on a half moon. So in the meantime, I guess. We're gonna go see the professor. Well, this ought to be fun. Yeah. So yeah, it seems like, I wonder if it's like a half moon every fourth night then. <laughs> the hell is that? Whoa, he's... There's a corpse here. 
desiccated animal corpse. Yeah. Yes, depending on how fast the moon phases, that's like an almost full moon. If the next one turns out to be a full moon, know about when to come back I've been, I've been streaming this game for like a month now. I know there was like a week I had off, but... Like, damn. to have a easy whoa hey you don't want to involve yourself with this hey get yourself out of there you don't like visitors huh you goddamn idiot <laughs> you don't want to see what happens if you don't leave Kinda do. I ain't here to cause trouble. What a joke. Well now, up to no good, are we? See you in hell. This ain't gonna end well for you. I would have actually shot him, but I I knew if I antagonize somebody, I swear that makes the game spawn somebody else. So then I would have had this whole damn witness murder chain happening. I swear that always happens. Like as soon as you actually just murder somebody, oh witness, and then you kill that guy. Oh, there's another witness, and it's just like this endless train of people that start spawning. <laughs> I swear it happens every time. Still haven't found a three star uh, croc yet.
There's a three star gator over there. I think the Springfield rifle can do it. The rolling rock might be able to do it too. It's a good pill. Perfect skin, nice. <laughs> well, <laughs> just brain over something. So Looks like it's already been skinned. Oh, it's a rotten possum. Oh wait, is that the one off my horse? Did I keep... It might be the one off my horse, actually. I'm not sure what a possum would be doing down here. So let's go ahead and take this, because like that. I want to take this to the trapper first, just before anything happens. Because I'm sure this can go to him for crafting. While we're here, Levi's crop short again. Wonder what they'll say this time. That's what I've been hearing. <laughs> All right, let's finally see this thing. <laughs> the horror that this is going to unleash. <laughs> you 
you're going to be in a better place. Uh, stay calm. Uh, breathe deep and repent, or you will be moved to a better realm. Ladies and gentlemen, behold the calm removal of this man's existence. <laughs> Um. In incredible! He's nearly dead! <laughs> so humane! Oh lord. Ah! It's not enough juice! Ah! Oh god, his eyes are gonna boil. Oh, his life may have been troubled, but his passing is... Peaceful! Kill him already! Somebody shoot me! Please! Oh, let's get up. You don't seem overly humane to me. I think it's mighty fine. <laughs> They're both dead. God, no, please. <laughs> well, he's sucking his own dick in hell now. Well, <laughs> a little bit of dishonor, I'm sure, but. I guess that's the end of that, isn't it? I'm surprised his eyes didn't pop out. Boil. Oh gracious! Fine day to you. <laughs> oh gracious, fine day to you. Ugh. to me sounds very low and I'm wondering if one of the rats accidentally kicked one of the volume knobs that I'm just not aware of. Please, I need help here. Whatever is the matter? The saloon is absolutely overrun with rats. Again? Worse than last time. Much, much worse. I can't get near the damn things. Scurrying around. But I need them gone. I'll pay double from the last time, huh? Yeah? Jesus, fella. Won't say no to the money, though. Oh, thank God. Head in there, but please, please, try not to destroy the place. Ugh. I hate this one. Because I like rats. Rats are good creatures. <laughs> Like studying them. Where is there? Where is there? real good way of doing this. Let's check. Not that. Is there any way to get a good rat carcass? Oh, 
don't know if there is. Perfect fur can be used to craft a hat. Oh, look how cute they are. <laughs> They're absolutely adorable. that and small uh, animal arrows can't really study them there's no option to study them Let me get out there hey where you going I still see him lording around in there yeah I don't think you can Perfect. Yeah, you can. I think the arrow bounced. <laughs> Spot on. That's all I can have. <laughs> yeah, maximum of five. Oh, they're in perfect condition, though. Oh, I hate that they're making me do this. <laughs> uh. It's the same with foxes, though. I hate when, like, games make me kill a fox. I can't seem to get the one that's on the counter. <laughs> Triple kill. That might have already been dead.
All right, dude. Never make me do this again. <laughs> this is horrible. Well, shit. Thank you, mister. You earned this, that's for sure. You got it. Yeah, sure, I gain honor, but at what cost? Try this again. <laughs> just a little, just a hair less stupid. <laughs> For fuck's sake, hitch the horse and take a shit. Sure, why not? Look like he wants them for anything. So he doesn't want them for crafting. I hope you make something pretty with that. So poor ones. Hey, Dark Omen. So we have to take those back to camp. Man. Hello, man. Best trapper I ever knew. My fourth wife. Native. You'd find a trail while the bloodhound was still sniffing its own ass. Hell of a woman. Best her soul. Actually, I don't think he says sell for crafting, though, does he? I'd wager I can travel faster with this stall and tow than you or anyone can with nothing but a horse and a saddle. It's not about speed, it's about knowing the land. Sell to stores. You want my wares? Right here's the one place to find them. Quality hide makes the for some reason I forget with him. I think Don't if you, as long as it says it's for crafting. Actually needs anything that involves rat hides. Every one of my garments is a little different. Because every pelt is a little different. You'll find them nowhere else. Is 
doesn't like it doesn't even look like he uses I don't sell this might not be for the legendary you want my stuff, wares? right here's the one place to find them we could get a badger hat need 10 perfect rat pelts okay so if it says for crafting then yeah okay if you need ten, you can only carry five. Oh, the things I'd do if I had your youth. These days I'm fishing more and tracking less. My old man was right. Okay, yeah, but I can you. sell these to him ah, then. You make me feel young. How are you? Alright, let's have a look. Pleasure doing business with you. Good use of that. Of crafting are sold. Pleasure doing business with you. Yeah, I think it'll just say can be sold if it doesn't go into crafting. Finally picked this up last night. What are the keys to push for to use Dead Eye? Um, there is a specific button apparently, but I just use Hello. middle mouse button. So the the scroll wheel, just click it. And as long as you have the gun out, it'll go into Dead Eye. If his no gun isn't out, he goes into like tracking mode. So and eventually, you get the skill where you can actually set the target yourself and when you get that skill while you're in dead eye mode hit Q and then Q will allow you to select your target how far have you gotten into it are you enjoying it is there another mission here oh yeah let's I want to see Mary it takes some getting used to this game when I first started playing and I wasn't sure if I was gonna like it or not but once I got used to everything, it was like, okay, I really enjoy this game now. Hold on. Is that your phone gave you a weather alert that simply said, it's cold outside, stay cozy inside. We're all a little cozy inside. You were at the train when you hit that, and it just went crazy targeting all your shots at one person. Yeah, before you get the skill, um, I forget how you get the skill, but before you get it, it just auto-targets. So, as soon as your reticle highlights somebody, it just slaps the target on them. It's later on when you get the skill that you can do it yourself. Arthur! Because I was a bit confused about that myself. You came. Yeah, I came. <laughs> so, uh, what do you need? Where are those two? Wait there. I'm coming straight down. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The fuck. Arthur. Hello, Mary. You came. Sure. Whenever you call for me, I'll come. Uh, oh, Arthur. What's wrong? Daddy. Your father? I'm a bigger fool than I <laughs> even thought. I'm begging you, Arthur. I know Daddy was not 
kind to you, but... But surely you cannot hate a man for the sin of loving his daughter and wanting better for her than... than... Than me? Than the choices you what make. What choice did I have? Did I ever have? Oh, I know. You had to live by your code. But your code is... Well, it's not right. Has your way been right, Mary? With you? And Jamie joining a bunch of crazies? And hypocritical daddy with his drinking and horn and gambling? Huh? Is that what a pure life has gotten you? Begging me for help? Oh, Arthur. Be kind to me. Why? Please. I'm sorry. I am... I should have asked someone else, but... But I'm the best guy you know at frightening decent people. It wasn't that I didn't love you, Arthur. You know that. Mm. Oh, Arthur. We were so very young. Look at those chops. Think how different life could have been. Yeah, I think about it. A lot. It all seems so long ago and far away now. Will you help me try to save Daddy? Fine. Come along, Dan. Where are we going? What's the old lovable patriarch been up to now? Oh, Arthur. You know sarcasm is beneath you. <laughs> He's been gambling and drinking and other things. Oh, the filthy rotter. Where can we find him? He said he was going down to the Theodore Eckhart stables. Something about a horse. It's down by the water in the warehouse district near the train yard. Come on, then. Don't be a pompous ass, Arthur. It doesn't suit you. Oh, should I leave that to Daddy? Leave Daddy alone. He suffers enough. Well, Good I Lord, lady. I can take some consolation in that. No, oh, Arthur. I should have ran away with you years ago. Why? So you could just fucking you no bitch at me every two seconds? But well, I don't know. Quit tone placing me, Jesus Christ. So what do you think he's up to? I'm not sure. He keeps saying it's a disgrace a man of his standing has to ride around on some old nag. Standing? He's usually falling down. Arthur. He wasn't always this way, but it has got worse. He's drinking and gambling more than ever, pawning things off left and right, mixing with bad people. I'm just scared for him. Don't worry too much. Whatever it is, we'll work it out. God damn. <laughs> you enjoying it so far so you just got to Valentine? Yeah, it took me about one play session to actually kind of decide I was gonna like the game. But it was just like, it, it was getting used to the engine. I hadn't played GTA in quite a while, so the engine's always kind of, it always feels a bit different for some reason. Uh, once I got settled, I've been enjoying it quite a bit. What kind of a state he's in? Sure. What? Do you just need I'll me for a ride or what? Scream if you need any help. Very funny. God damn. She has like zero sense of humor at all. You can't stand there. What in the street? Yes, in the street. Is it your street? Just get out of here. Why? I said, just get out of here. Listen, partner. I'm waiting on a lady. She's a fine lady. She's just gone inside. If I wasn't waiting on this lady, you'd be dead already. 
<laughs> but if you continue to irritate me, I'll kill you. I make my apologies to the lady. It's your call. Oh, I didn't mean nothing. Apology accepted. Oh, I wait right there. I have half a mind to kill you myself. Daddy. No. Oh, Daddy, please, come home. You're tired, Daddy, tired and I have unwell. no such thing. You get away from me. You head home. I insist upon it. Leave me be. Damn nuisance. Excuse me, partner. Still as charming as ever, I see. Oh, Arthur, he's up to no good. We better follow him. Why? Okay. This way. Sometimes you don't like the third person, but you can't say the first person. You he can't play first person with this engine. Yeah, I guess there is first person mode, isn't there? Yeah. I mean I like the third person once you get used to it. It just like I say takes getting used to. Hold up, Arthur. You can see why he has such a high opinion of himself. It's like it's it's it's, it's always the movement, like Arthur, come on. How everyone, like, kind of swings when crates. they move. Don't lose sight of him. Come here, <laughs> quick. Mind where you go. Mind where you go. Sorry? Do you think he saw us? I don't think so. What did you say to me? I didn't say a thing insulting. I'll wipe that goddamn smirk clean off your face. <laughs> Ain't you a little old for brawling, mister? Damn you! He's heading across the road. You know, this is kind of fun. Shh, he'll hear you. No, I won't. You could have cleaned yourself up a bit. I didn't realize I was here to impress anyone. What? What's wrong with my chops? Best damn chops this side of the Mississippi. He just went left down that alleyway. What's he doing? Let's go find out. Don't say I never show you a good time. I'm just glad you're here. No, you're not. I'm glad I'm here to do something for you. What's he doing? What do you think he's doing? Well, he's either waiting for a woman of dubious morals, or he's trying to sell something. So, Ashton, you got the money? Seems he's selling something. Have you got the brooch, Mr. Gillis? Yes. Here. Here's the money. <laughs> mm, that is beautiful. It's a family heirloom. That was it's mother's brooch. Not any longer, Mr. Gillis. Enjoy the money, and should you need any more, I can offer you a loan at a very reasonable rate of interest. No, thank you. I've heard what happens to folks who take loans from you. It's not I've his to sell. Oh, it's like just a brooch. At least he didn't get himself Come killed. You don't understand. Mother left it to me. Yeah. You sold my mother's brooch? How could you? You! That's theft! Oh, speaking of thieves, I, I see you found your outlaw again. Hello, sir. Have you been well? Daddy, how could you? Mary, wait here. I'll go get the brooch. Don't hurt anyone, Arthur. He'll probably kill someone. I'm hoping. And if all goes well, right. I will kill you someone. Bastard. Hold her right there. Here we go. <laughs> right, 
doing this on foot. <laughs> Bye. Do you know who I am? I think I'm quite aware of who you are. More than aware of who you are. wasn't Gillis's to sell. I bought it fair and square. <sighs> How much do you want for it? I guess I could give it to you for a hundred dollars. A hundred? What do you take me for? Okay, I mean, okay. I'm very good for the money, but... <laughs> I'm a reasonable man. Let's say 50. Not good enough, Ashton. Okay, Jesus! Twenty-five dollars, that's my final offer. Take the damn thing. Thank you. You crazy son of a bitch. I'm you sorry. You don't know who you're messing with. Somebody's gonna pay for this. <laughs> Let's go, girl. Yep. Oh, it's gonna force me back. Um, you should just have a horse brush, I think. You should be able to just go up to your horse and brush it, or you get one at some point. I think, because eventually you have to, like, trade in a horse, and I think you, you might get the kit then, maybe? If you don't have it already. Where's your father? I don't know. You want me to find him again? Not really. Well, let's take a walk. I'll take you to the trolley. Oh, it's great. Thank you. I think you get one, um... When you go to like learn about the 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 horse yeah. stables, got you your brooch back. But I never bought I one. Miss. I don't think. Probably best not. Hey, what are you doing now, right this moment? Why, yes. <laughs> well, I was. Wondering if you wanted to do something. Uh, head to the theater, perhaps. Uh. Sure. Theater? Me? Sure, why not? It'll be fun, Arthur. Let's go to the Relure. They have the strangest acts. <laughs> strangest I can handle. Well, it's the normal business of life. I can't seem to get a grip on it. <laughs> you and me both, Arthur. Oh, I've missed you. Don't start. <laughs> You're an idiot. But you'll always be my friend. Well, of course I'm your friend, but... <laughs> you ain't always fair with me. If I was fair with you and a good person, I'd have had you hanged a long time ago. Well... 
That's true. <laughs> so, shut up and act like a gentleman, or at least try to for once in your brainless life. You're not a very nice woman. No, <laughs> she isn't. Well, look at the company I keep. I know, it's quite dreadful, isn't it? <laughs> Sort of beautiful, in a gaudy and tasteless way. That's the only way I know. <laughs> Thank you. Well, no, I didn't mean it like that. I'm sure. <clears throat> you silly man. Come on, let's go find our seats. Does that sign just change? <laughs> How about here on the right? Sure. After you. So that or you can just buy one at the horse stable, but I think you get one when you learn about the horse stables. Welcome! <laughs> and thank you for that thunderous applause. I am Aldridge T. Abington, the greatest no assembler doubt. of entertainment since Nero himself. Do not doubt. As a child, when I walked the horse manure covered better. streets of Saint Denis, I never dreamed of the stir I would create so, in this locality. Just as starting a or not. Are you in of a the rush, The greatest Arthur? show ever assembled. Prepare for the grandest excitement of your curiosity. Fire, snakes, and magic. I encourage any of you to dabble in all three if you have a settled aversion to manual labor as I do. For entertainment is a gift that will see you through the winter better than any packed larder or root cellar full of canned goods. Gonna call bullshit on that. Now, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome a truly stunning musical performance to the stage, Miss Robin Koninsky! her. I think we've seen her before. Thank you for joining us. Now let's talk a little bit about this place we all love called Saint Denis. I mean, you'll be fine if you if your horse um, is dirty. It just a bit slow on the uh, rest restorations. I mostly forget to brush my horse, so. Thanks, fire and magic, huh? Doesn't look like any of that is here. I know so far. Yeah. There's a hunting down to San Denis. 
flawless. Perfect. Oh, I see you. You, you love her dulcet tones, right? Yes, she is pure spectacle, and I assure you she can charm any beast, any beast at all, from cockroach to killer whale. <laughs> Your mother most likely told you not to play with fire or to spend time in the company of strange women. You are about to do both. Is this why I don't have friends? <laughs> Miss Antoinette Sanserino. People say stay away from me. Stop it. Wonderful. We did see this act. On with the show. It's different though. You can see how this could go horribly wrong. I hope she stays away from the curtain. Not a whole lot of dancing, but I guess by the day's standards. That's the first twerk. Basically, the torches she's holding aren't that much. It's the ones that are around her hips, of course. But I guess it wouldn't be much of a show if it was just the hula hoop of fire. It's the burning ring of fire. they've basically made complete shows in this game like <laughs> an actual just full on stage performances yeah I'm telling Arthur to say that you can't see it but there's a prompt behind me where I can either cheer or antagonize I don't think it really does anything at all just so you can participate. Oh, enchanting! Mesmerizing! This guy. She is truly ah. one to bring home to mother. <laughs> it is said that there is a place in France where the naked ladies dance. I have been there. Prepare for the body braziers of the Petit Flaneur in Gay Paris. And they change sets pretty fast.
Watch this music get hit on YouTube, even though it's probably public domain. <laughs> on ankle. Blocked to Twitch stream. I know. I've, I've more than once gotten a copyright hit for like absolute public domain music. Like old orchestral stuff that's over 200 years old. If not older, well, a lot older. Like 400 year old. You know, really old music. Obviously, it's public domain, and then YouTube gives me a fucking copyright hit on it. Because apparently the excuse is you you can't claim the music itself, but you can claim the performance. But if it's just music, you don't know who's performing it, so... Apparently that's an excuse how they get away with it. Whoa, incredible! Aren't they lovely? Oh. Those legs are a sight to behold. I am spent. <laughs> Each of my shows is truly incredulous. Awe-inspiring, and I'm sure you enjoyed. Thank you. <laughs> we flounder through the morass of humanity with only bright moments like these before it all goes dim and snuffs out in silence. So thank you. What a lovely evening. Come back tomorrow. All right. Well, shall we? Yes. That was fun, Arthur. <laughs> it was. <laughs> All right. You better take me to the trolley now, Mr. Morgan. Of course. <laughs> Quite ridiculous, but somehow very amusing. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> My life wasn't supposed to... Oh. Is it too late for us, Arthur? Yep. I can't lie to you. I'm a wanted man, Mary. If I... If anyone... Close to me, well, they wanted to, and I can't have you wrapped up in there. But it's coming to an end. This time it really is. Run away with me, Arthur. Run away right now and don't look back. I want to. More than anything, I want to. But I've got some people I need to take care of. But once they're free, then I'm free. Then I can disappear. But Arthur... If we're gonna run away anywhere, we'd need money. Soon, I'll have some. I know you won't run away. But it's a pretty dream. Very pretty. But I will, once I get some money. And I had some. But then some fool got her trapped into a town that I can't go back to. That's another story. I'll write you.
soon I'll have some, says the guy with what- Yeah, I know, I've got like 6,000 bucks. I'm- I'm good. <laughs> YouTube can fuck off. You pay for Google Music. I like their player better and most time you keep music on their servers and most music places don't do that anymore. Hey. Yes, yeah, so it had quite a bit of depth to Arthur, isn't there? Well, I mean, Google owned YouTube, essentially, so the same company, but, yeah. YouTube is pretty much a shithole. <laughs> like, almost, especially, um... There's so many gaming YouTubers, especially, that are just now making Twitch and Mixer their primary... Um... Gaming platforms now. Entertainment platforms. Like, they'll still do YouTube, but now now YouTube's like the side gig. The streaming is the, the big one. I'm sorry, what? What you are, little fella? Kids the only ones you're safe and salty, huh? I don't like your face. Would you just back the hell off? Just so stay away. Just, just let me get out of here, all right? Let me take a look at you, tough guy. Listen, get the hell away from me! Run back to mama! Oh God, please no! <laughs> Hi. <laughs> there we go. Uh. <laughs> This game does let you do some great things sometimes. Uh, this game is is wonkiness and, and all kinds of things, but it has its moments. And I guess already you're aware, Dark Omen, make sure you're playing the game in borderless windowed mode. Because if it's full screen, you'll get to that quest you can't do with, with it in full screen. That fastest is back yet. I don't like tormenting that guy. He's usually on this corner over here. Is he there? Nah, he's not there. Oh my god. It is me, Charles Chatonnet, the painter. <laughs> okay. What are you dressed up like that for? Oh, I am a wanted man, persecuted for my art. Well, as bad as it is, <laughs> I don't think that the art is the problem. In Paris, they say leave. Go far away. We will never understand you here. I say, I go to Saint Denis. They say that is not far enough. <laughs> it seems to me that they were right. It doesn't matter. Now, I go to South Pacific. They always tell me the light there is perfect for my work. Well, so long as they weren't telling you that just to get you on the other side of the world. Perhaps. It doesn't matter. Help me get to the next ship. They are watching the port, and I need a chaperone. <sighs> okay, come on. Oh. I'll tell you what I want, miss. Civilization, so aggressive, so stifling. I can hardly breathe in this city. Yeah, I kind of know what you mean. 
Why I thought I would find my way in a country founded by Puritans, I never know. Aside from money and travel being slow, so much easier to like travel elsewhere. Like less restrictions. <laughs> we are away. Come now, follow me. Those fellas, you remind me. You do that full screen. But of course, I needed to shit. Hey, oh, so you could actually talk to Dutch then. Was better than any of the drinks they served in there. Remind me to avoid that place. I don't know if it's a periodic bug or if it's a guaranteed bug for that one that locked to that quest. We go through here. How would they know to look for you in the dress? Where did I just get money from? I thought I knew him. Ugh. Please do not do that again. Huh. Now get moving, come on. Evening, friend. That'd be the bristliest so, kiss ever. <laughs> you ain't so none of your work. There is always a heavy demand for fresh mediocrity, but new kinds of failures. Not so much. A new kind? The free in the you a long way from the ranch, cowboy. Where are you going, pretty lady? Anywhere you want, mon ami. Oh, oh my goodness. This way, to the end of the docks. Something gayer. A purple, perhaps? We are in Saint Denis, after all. What are you looking at? <sighs> Bar shipping, money borrowing, wife stealing. You sure got a way of ingratiating yourself with people. If the purpose of life was to be liked, it would be very boring indeed. I've developed the feeling the purpose ain't to be hated. Hate, love, they are the same. I provoke, I challenge, I amuse, do I not? With my impropriety, a mediocre life is meaningless. A bold life filled with art and truth, dirty truth, that is something that ma Look at you, pretty little thing! Oh, oh, oh. Hello, boys. Come on. Come on back now, baby. <laughs> The sailors know who they're bunking with. We have many weeks together. We will get to know each other well. Well, good luck to all of you. Relax. Hey, up here. She is my ship. <laughs> Adieu, 
Merci, mon ami. So long. If they don't like you in the islands, keep on going to the South Pole. Ah, yes. I hear there. The light is really fantastic. Ah, au revoir. Sake, you didn't know it's me. My bucks, I can deal with that. <laughs> oh, so you didn't have the issue where you had to touch ducks so you could tell him to take the lead, huh? So it was absolutely a bug for me. Let's go pay off this stupid bounty. Speaking of, what's the moon like? Oh, shit, it's a half moon. Already. It's you! I got you now, you goddamn scoundrel! Come on! Let's you just talk this through! High or you're taking the bullet. Oh, okay, you got me. Oh, me Get deal. down right now. Okay, take it easy. It's for five bucks. God damn it, you're going in a cell. No more chances. What the shit? Enjoy that. It's worth the extra twenty-five. did nothing wrong there. I actually surrendered and he still shot at me. Oh. 
bomb. I don't think I can lose them. They're pretty quick. Such bullshit, though. I actually surrendered, and he still shot me. What the fuck did he want me to do? I think you're dead ass staying on me, too. Well, I mean, he, I, I guess, yeah. In all fairness, he is a police officer, so... I mean... <laughs> of course he was just gonna shoot at me anyway. things change, the more things stay the same. It was pretty much enticing me to rack up my bounty, too. I think that's the funny thing about it. It was pretty much like enticing me to keep racking up that bounty. Let's get you looking good. Again, sir. Hmm, I thought you were sweating a little. Not really. I imagine there's people out there that are playing like sir, good morning. the no the no bounty challenge. Like if you get a bounty you just don't pay it off. Because in many cases, the game does force a bounty on you. Like, you just don't have a choice. You will get a bounty. It's part of the storyline. Okay, well, there's nothing left to do in town anyway. By the looks of it. We can head back to camp and... Try another carriage. I did one already. God. Oh, hell of a night, Arthur. Right, so it was a half moon last night, so it means we've got to wait another couple nights, I guess. Yeah. 
Still, can't believe that asshole shot me over five bucks. <laughs> five dollar bounty and you start shooting me. For five bucks. I'm sure people playing this like you play GTA, steal horses, kill and rob as much and don't care if the police chase you. Morning. Yeah, you could do that. I'd be tempted to try that. You'll just basically spend a lot of time being very wanted, having oh, hey. bounty. Look who it is? I'm still picking the dust out from my teeth. Hey, it's so you. So what do you say we go again? Oh. First one of Catfish Jacksons. Again? How could I say no? Ready? Let's go. We did this last time. Shit. <laughs> Let's take it slow. Let's take it slow through here. Had the edge today. Damn it, not again. My horse's I'm speed has improved. Send this horse to the bone yard. Well, my horse is now faster. Nice. So there's a point to doing the races other than just money. I think there was a wild cat back there. I saw a red blip on my mat for a moment. Which, if that's the case, let's go ahead and get out. This is a wildcat area. Condition too. Just hold on there, girl. <laughs> Always like if the skin is in an odd place, if the corpse is in an odd place, the skinning just happens instantly. Encountered one in this exact corner before, but it caught me by such surprise I didn't have a weapon ready. I basically obliterated the the, the carcass. Yep. Son back home. Oh man. 
There's another game that came out recently that I really want to... Uh, that I hope to get. Um, it's a VR game. It's, it's a Walking Dead VR game that uh, came out last week. And it's rated pretty good. And I watched just a little bit of it and it looks pretty fun. Killed two ducks and ran over a squirrel. <laughs> nice. I, I, I hit a crow once. I don't know how it happened, but I was riding my horse really fast. And I went by a tree and then just suddenly blap. <laughs> Apparently, Arthur took a crow to the face and it killed the crow. Bastards are always sitting here. Let's go ahead and take care of them. It wasn't the blues. We were storing powder here. Someone dropped the Lucifer, and that was that. They weren't the traitors. I guess we wouldn't have had powder there. They hadn't been no war, and that feller wouldn't have dropped his match. They ruined everything. Get just a little bit closer. Better keep your eyes open. If anyone comes fighting, and they get no the more and welcome. These guys are here every time I pass by. Like, we're both just reloading. <laughs> that was a mess. We're both just standing there whiffing our shots. Gotta get used to reloading after every shot. Certain guns, yeah, have to reload after every shot. Like your car, well, your carbine has to be uh, pumped in order to shoot. Which I think they do automatically if you stop aiming, but I can't remember.
my buck, so I got my money back for... Nice. For a bit of my money back. Box. Large jewelry bag. Nice. We sold for cash. you like the loneliness of the game. Wait, what? Which point do you like the loneliness of the game? The reading for a time, but you're sure the more you play, the more that might get annoying? Oh, you mean the slowness of the game. You like the slowness of the game. I think the pacing of the game is quite good. The only thing that's ever gotten kind of... Maybe a little bit annoying... Well, at the start, uh, one thing that was kind of annoying was just like the constant horse riding, but I actually don't mind it anymore. Once I kind of got used to the distance between everything, I actually just don't mind taking my horse out and just riding it all over the place. Yeah, that's really the only thing I kind of found annoying about it. I think that's kind of what makes the game the pace it is, is just that distance between everything. Who's that? Arthur! Dumbass! Good to see you back, Arthur. Easy now. Of course, there's there's sometimes that control wonkiness that happens that gets annoying, but it almost seems like sometimes when it happens, it almost just causes funny things to occur. Like when my horse weirdly headbutts me off. <laughs> it's headbutts a wall and I go flying off for no reason whatsoever. Where do you go to upgrade camp? Um, It should just come up as like a money symbol on your map. If you don't see it, maybe you can't do it yet. Don't forget to go hunting, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, I will. I've been hunting. Who else is hunting? Hunting for funds. I need to keep the squirrel carcasses because I need them for something else. So nobody needs this raccoon pelt because I've got enough. See what says donate for crafting. Nope. Everything's for fun, so he doesn't even need anything. So I can donate the panther carcass now. Good. We really needed this. 
Thank you, Arthur. Mr. Morgan, bring me some materials, and I'll be glad to make something nice for you. Still need an elk pelt for this. And... Oh yeah, I still need that bison pelt. I don't seem to have a gun that I can actually nicely kill a bison. We need those advanced arrows, I guess. Then what did we... We killed the bison before. I need for the valuable cinch. I need a beaver pelt. I don't know if I've seen any beavers. I reckon I need to get my hands on some materials first. Mr. Morgan. Are you keeping Abigail? But yeah, that marker that's flashing on my map is no, what never, your uh, ledger should look like. Never told you this, but so it should be this one that's flickering right here. Just means it's upstairs, but it should be like a, this little money symbol. It should be at Dutch. Well. It should be at Dutch's tent, uh, behind his tent. Because until you get to this place, uh, yeah, it's, there's always, it's always right behind Dutch's tent. You're quite a woman. Thank you. Quiet. This is all I got for now. And you all ain't so bad. Abigail, she's as good as they come. So everyone keeps telling me. The lovely Miss Jones. So yeah. Until you get Hello. here, it's it's behind Dutch's place. Fine. But yeah, uh, I don't know if you can do it yet, depending on how early on you are. Sometimes sometimes it just doesn't show it to you because you just can't. Yeah, here it is in Dutch's room here. This is this. Yeah, you have to aim at it, because, I mean, you know, you just saw right there. I was standing in front of it, but it told me I could only sit in the chair. Like, right now, I'm looking right at it, and it's not pinging. <laughs> and right now, I'm standing right in front of it. And there's there's no option, it just says sit. <laughs> and there, ah, look, there, now, now it shows up. <laughs> So now you can see it. Oh yeah, I need to turn in the debts. I feel like I don't need to contribute anymore. I've contributed well more than this camp ever needs. Okay, you might not be able to upgrade your camp then. Or you might have to like walk a little bit closer to the ledger, but if you don't see a green book or if you're standing in front of it and it doesn't work, Uh, you might not be able to donate to camp yet. I think it'll kind of tell you when you can. It'll, like, give you a quick... Like, a little, hey, this is a thing you can do. How's it going? I feel wonderful. Good for you. Need some cartridges. Well, it's a bit too early to start, uh, too late, I mean, to start anything else, so... I think, yeah, we'll stop here then. And continue on next time. Yeah, game always feel, the game always feels a little bit overwhelming at first because they just like throw, push this button, push that button, push all these buttons.
this button does this, this button does that, and then you get like overwhelmed, and you're just like, what am I supposed to, what does what? You eventually get used to it. Just takes a moment. Or sometimes you have instances, like yesterday, where I tried to cut a woman loose, and instead it quickly flicked to kick her. <laughs> exactly what happened yesterday. Because the camera just slightly pivoted in such a way that it went from cut loose to kick. And so instead of saving this woman, I kicked her to death. <laughs> it happens. Oh, well. All right, then. Um, so tomorrow. Tomorrow is usually my day off. I think I'm going to go ahead and make tomorrow my day off. Um, but we'll see. There's a small chance I might pick up the stream tomorrow. Um, but I still have some work I need to get done, so I might just be off tomorrow. Keys are okay. It's the little things like wanting to build the camp, which you can't, can't until it allows you. Yeah, it can be like that. But I mean, in all honesty, if you didn't know about it, it wouldn't bother you. <laughs> it's kind of the same with me because I knew it was a thing. And it, it's kind of one of those games where it, you don't know if you can't do it because the game says you can't do it or if you can't do it because you're just not doing it right. Because, like, for me, it took me, like, half the game to figure out how to make small game arrows. I didn't realize I knew how to make it the whole time. And then it was, like, the, the river lure for fishing. I couldn't actually even get it until a certain point in the game. And so it's kind of like stuff like that, yeah, that you... The game tells you you need this or that, but you don't know if it's just not unlocked yet or if you just haven't figured out how to do it. <laughs> it's basically it's basically how the game is and that can be that can be frustrating. Cuz like it wasn't until recently I could even get the river lures even though the game was telling me you need a river lure for this and it's just like, "Oh, I'm not going to be able to do this for several more hours of gameplay." But like with the camp, yeah, if you if you know there's the camp, then yeah, so it's it's a bit tricky. Sometimes sometimes I recommend just looking stuff up. <laughs> like with the small game arrows, I had to do that in the end cuz it was then I realized that yeah, I was making a mistake. And that was the whole reason I couldn't make them. And like with the river lure, I think I eventually looked up the river lure and it was like, "Oh yeah, you have to go to this location." And it didn't didn't even unlock for a while, so Sometimes just look it up. <laughs> That's all you can really do. Because it doesn't always tell you when it's locked and when it's not. But yeah. Alright, so yeah. There, there's a very small chance I'll be on tomorrow, but I probably won't. Um, but I will be back on Thursday and continue for Thursday and Friday. Um, let's see, I'm still... I've been doing my work in the evening, but I still got... A fair bit of work to do, so I'm going to try to take tomorrow to do it. But otherwise, um, thank you guys for joining me. Um, hope you guys had a good time. Hope you enjoy the game Dark Omen. It's really good. I, I've, I've come to love it. Um, and yeah, I should be back on Thursday, so... That's all. <laughs> I'll be back on Thursday and we'll continue with this. Um, so there we go. All right, guys. Well, have a great day. Have a great afternoon and have a great tomorrow. And if I don't see you tomorrow, I'll be back on Thursday. So have a great one and I'll see you guys then. <laughs>